Hello and welcome to episode 25 of the Milk Bar podcast, which is a bi-weekly Milkmen production. Today, I'm joined by Ellis, Chris, myself, Oshan, Stephen, and we got Angus Frank just chilling over there on the worktop. What a cutie. Where are we? What are we where are we? We're in some random caravan today. What's, uh, what's going we'll on? We'll just let the comms decide whose caravan it is. Yeah. The communists. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, we're going to be filming today in a caravan. It's quite cozy. It I enjoy this. I was just saying before, wasn't I? It's warmer than my house because I don't have any fucking radiators. You've uh, recently installed some insulation in your new lounge. We're not oh, going to go into that. It's boring as fuck. Um, <laughs> we won't, but was it a success? Wait, wait, wait. Hang Stop right now. You've got a house. Oh, my <laughs> fucking what? By the way, everyone, I have a house. So this is the first time mentioning this. Um, yeah, about seven months ago, we... Uh, oh, no, actually, funnily enough, mm. it was like... Um, Three or four days ago was a year since we went and looked at the house for the first time. Oh, wow. And when we first looked, we were like, eh. We weren't <laughs> asked. We were like, eh, shit all. Um, but we couldn't afford anything else. So we're stuck with the bare walls that, well, you've seen it. It looks shit. That's a bear in the wall. <laughs> <laughs> What's everyone been up to? <laughs> <laughs> we all look at Steve and he's like, nothing. Cannot compute. Much, yeah. not Nothing's happened. That's I mean, all. Well, um, all right. Yeah. Stuff has happened. Now, Chris, stuff has happened. I got him after shave. Oh, yeah. No, he did, yeah. actually. <laughs> I got this is a story. No, he didn't. Not the same one. What? No, he, he just stole the same bottle. <laughs> he, he got a nice one. And I got the same one. From I always oh, well, I thought you meant uh, as him. Yeah, I was he like, worded what? that so yeah, weird. You were like, I got yeah, a new like, one, and I was like, well, I got the same one. Yeah, and I got the same one. Yeah, as if you got the same one as him, no. but no, he, yeah. you got the same one that you normally get. <laughs> what, you, got yeah. him, you got to say what he did in the show. <laughs> yeah. All right. yeah. Okay, Can so. I find out what the actual aftershave is oh, now. So, because sorry, I'm sorry, yeah, okay, so I, well, actually, do you know what I said to him? I went. <laughs> Because I went with like boots, didn't we? And it was just shit. Because it's just like. There's nothing They'd all been nicked. Okay. And then. All the testers and that. So then we go to Superdrug and I was like, right, you have to, it's all behind the counter there, isn't it? Oh, yeah, yeah. So I said to him, I'm like, don't let them convince me to buy it because if you start talking to them, I'll just say yeah. <laughs> so then this lady starts serving us, literally like the first after shift. She goes, this is a brand new one. And it was like this little robot guy. As soon as I saw the robot, I was like, <laughs> sold. From it's like um, those things as kids and with shoes, they would come with a little toy. Do you toy remember those? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I never got one. <laughs> Just bring that. No worries, mate. <laughs> so yeah, it was nice. It was What's nice it called? One. What? It's a Paco Rabanne Phantom, I think. It is really nice, though. Oh, like, okay. I think I might go and get one. <laughs> but it's funny, though, because he did literally say, don't let me buy anything. Do not let them, like, peer pressure me. And then as soon as she went, do you want it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then Stephen, oh, yeah. my God. So How Stephen does... met up with us later on, yeah. right? Um we were at a shopping park and then he, uh, I was like, do you want to get anything? And he went, oh, I might, might get some aftershave while I'm here. So we went to the, fra was it the fragrance yeah. store or yeah. something? We went in there and then, you know, we tried a few different ones. They all and he smelt the same. Yeah. He wasn't that arsed. He was just like, like yeah, they all smell. Yeah. She let me fall. Like, she kept spraying. and was like, oh, this is nice. And they were all going, oh, this is really nice. I was You've like, yeah, nose we, blind. The same we could smell. tell the difference. Yeah. Whereas he was just like, they all just smell. He just, yeah. I was like, he goes, oh, they smell. And then at one point he held <laughs> all like four <laughs> testers. Yeah, you picked them all up and went, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then he just went, I'm just going to get the one that I normally get. Yeah. I'll be honest. Then, so we just wasted that woman's time, yeah. which is not very nice. But then she goes, then she, she goes, <laughs> what, what size do you want? want? And he just goes, the green one. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're, they're like, what? Because uh, sizes have different colours. Yeah, the, all the boxes are different colours. No, the they size. win. Yeah, they were. No, um, they win. Yeah, they were. No, but, like, that was, that was, was a different about. fucking the, aftershave. Um, the, the bottle, the tester bottle. Yeah, like, I, I meant like, want, what size do you want? But I meant like that tester bottle, like, you know, that that, that size one. of that one. Yeah. But it just came but out. That's what I was saying. One. And they were laughing at me. I was like, I know what I meant. I was pointing at it. I was like that, and she just was like. At least, at least she was laughing meant. along as well. Yeah, she was absolutely. It was funny was. though because I just went fucking hell. I'll have to get involved. Right, just, the big one is that all right? And then she's like, Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Um, so it's the exact same one Chris has got. No, no. <laughs> what? That's, that's what, what I mean. Yeah. He just he, says he, random no, bullshit no, no. and goes, "Why don't you get one. what I'm saying?" He, he bought a new one, but I bought the same one that I usually use. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So he, it's a pack or a ban? No. No. Again, he's just worded it wrong. Yeah. He's got the same one. So he's what had is before. it? He's got it's called Eternity, Calvin, Calvin, Calvin Klein, Klein, which is a nice one. I, I suggested it to him. Okay, it's yeah. a good one. 
I, I, it's just I actually do have that one as well. So. <laughs> Fucking hell. Just to confuse things more. Yeah. But anyway, but yeah, it was just funny the way he was like, but the, one. oh, do you know what? We haven't even brought this up, actually. We're going Greece, aren't we, this year? We are. We're going Zanti. Oi, Lutz, Lutz, Oi, Lutz. <laughs> um, for a lads holiday and I've made it sort of a tradition that every time I go to the airport I get a new aftershave so oh, I, okay. I think we no, all that's... should get like a different one that we haven't got before well I'm going to chest looking at you because you'll be like it smells the fucking same yeah it will <laughs> waste the money get my ladies one <laughs> it smells quite nice <laughs> I'm going to chest on Wednesday come in and I'm probably going on a hunt for some aftershaves. I'm on hunt. I'm on hunt for smelly stick. Nice. For what? What? A smelly stick. <laughs> the little sticks of uh, aftershave they put on. Are they called sticks? Paper? You know when you smell them, yeah, tasters. Tasters. <laughs> Tester. Tester. I know what you mean. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. When, when the woman, I taste funny. it as well because sometimes <laughs> you get thirsty. When the woman was doing them as well, like she'd hold one end and spray it, and she also just picked up the end she sprayed. And yeah, smelled. I get to and smell it. Picked though, the pig that has spun, she smit. Fucking hell, we're off the rails she today. Picked up the, <laughs> and she, picked up the one she sprayed at the side and yeah. just smelt the, the side that she hadn't, where her hand had been. Speaking in Simlish over there. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I don't talk. <laughs> no, you should, it's funny. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyone else got any news? Why are you looking at me? I'm, no, I'm just... All right, fucking hell. I just said Jeez, I'm going to Chester. <laughs> uh, I've got some news, which I can bring up on this podcast, because by the time it comes uh, out... Yes, you'll have, you'll have done it. Yeah. You're I'm, pregnant. No way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've put on a bit of timber. Um, <laughs> not that pregnant women are fat. <laughs> oh, they can be. On, we're going down a rabbit yeah, hole. You, no. um, I'm going to be asking my girlfriend to marry me. This wow. week. Wow. Anyway. Um, this is public. Uh, it's this week. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Thursday. Oh, was that the day you're doing it Thursday? Or is it you going on Thursday? I'm asking her on Thursday. It's going to be, uh, it's gonna be a bit awkward if she says no. And yeah, 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 Next point. <laughs> Paul the <laughs> <says, "No."> Oshan <laughs> <laughs> isn't in this episode because he killed himself. No, you'd be hanging there in the background. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. the window. Jesus. Oh. Um, do you want to tell the story about getting uh, the parents' permission? You ha- you've got a little story for it. You've told us. but. Have I? Yeah. Yeah. Because um, you've been planning it. Yeah. Like trying to get mm. the dad oh, separated. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah. So basically I asked him and he said yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> no, um Love it. I've been wanting I'd been wanting to ask him for like months, right? But um obviously when I go and see my girlfriend's parents, she's always there. Mm. So it was very difficult to I couldn't really ask him, can I marry daughter when she's there just it's not how you do it is it um so i've been trying to organize like takeaways or like we'll go around there for food and then you know whatever but each time it was like the mum would cancel or the you know my girlfriend would cancel or someone was busy or whatever so it just for months and months and months it was just like fucking hell like can you just stop (laughs) i'm just i'm trying to fucking ask you a question here and then finally we went around for a chinese but it doesn't deliver, so they do chicken. Um, <laughs> no. uh, well, yeah. So, um, they don't deliver, so uh, me and the dad had to go and pick it up, right? So we were waiting for it to be cooked, so we went to the pub, and I asked him in there. And I, w- I didn't think I'd be nervous, but I was fucking like... Wow, really? Oh, I yeah, didn't know that. Of course I was, yeah. I was well nervous. and I'm, It's weird. I know... I know now that I've done that, I will be fucking shit in my pants on Thursday. Mm. <laughs> but at the moment, I'm not. Do you know what I mean? No, no I get you. Where are you going? Are you going to tell me? You may as well say your plan. What you're yeah, going you must have you told us. Like, <laughs> yeah. <to> <laughs> um, so essentially, my girlfriend booked uh, John Mayer to go and watch John Mayer in Glasgow. Amazing. Um, and then I just went, oh, well, why don't we just stay a few days and then you know, we'll Make go to Edinburgh bit, yeah, and yeah. You know, have a little trip away. She was like, yeah, yeah, let's do that. And then I knew that she, Edinburgh was her like favorite place. So I was like, you know, that, if I was to ever ask, that's where I'd ask because that's her favorite place. But obviously she's booked everything for this trip, the hotels, what we're doing. She's got complete control. Yeah. So she'll have absolutely zero fucking clue 
that I'm going to be asking. Um, especially, I just, oh, why don't I, you know, it was like a on the whim sort of thing. Like, why don't we just do that? Not like, because if I'd have come to her and gone, I've booked Edinburgh. We're going to mm, go there and yeah, we've got like a be. nice meal. <clears throat> She'd have been like, mm, yeah. Her mind's huh? going to start wondering, just regardless, like yeah. imagining things. Yeah, so when you propose it to me, Alice. <laughs> <laughs> Funnily enough, we're going to Edinburgh. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, next podcast I'll be engaged, either engaged or depressed. Mm. One or the other. That's how it has to start. <laughs> no matter what, no intro. Just like she said yes. Just yeah. crying. She said no. <laughs> I just cry the whole. Oh, hour. not here. He hung himself. I swear I made that joke. Did she? Uh, yeah. Where have you been? <laughs> Where have you been? No, you just I'm, zoned out. Yeah. Just started talking. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'll tell you where he hasn't been. The Patreon, because no one subscribes to it. Um, starting from just what three pounds. Huh? What a segue. <laughs> no, it's Patreon. Um, starting from just three pound a month, which is just the price of a nice coffee. Well, it's actually less than a coffee now. They're like fucking six quid from Starbucks. Whoa. Yeah. Robbing little cunts, and I, I don't know why, but I keep going. Tasty though. Very tasty. Mm -hmm. Anyway, um, go to Patreon and check us out there. You get a great deal, and it will be helping us to produce these. Um, I've just broken one of my camera tripods, so I'm in dire need of some money. Please help me. Um, all right. Nice. Topic of the week, mm -hmm. which is a segment where some of the milkmen volunteered to tell a story of something that's happened to them recently or in the past in regards to a specific topic. So today's topic, hidden talents. Most hidden people have a hidden talent that they are really rarely get to share so has anyone got a hidden talent yeah i don't want to start i don't, I don't like how sinister yeah. that was yeah i was like oh, yeah. where's this going and I, like, was, I, I just i knew i was like ellis has got him well it's not pleasant Ooh. <laughs> and it's very large i can shit myself yeah. on demand <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, i can do that anyway but that's not a hidden talent hmm? you want know. your drink yeah that's my hidden talent him, yeah. Sorry, mate. i'm a good servant um, so I've kind of got double joints in, uh, like my forearms, I guess. I don't know how or what context I learned I could do this, but I can basically, I think I've shown you once a while ago, I can like put my arms behind my back and then bring them round. No, you're forgetting. You showed me that you can put your legs behind your back, behind your head. No, I can't when do we, that. No? Oh, sorry. I wish I could do that, but nah. When you were right shouting. over his head, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Didn't get it, though. No, I got okay. it, but still. <laughs> I'll work on it, baby. Don't worry. Hmm. You're I don't like the baby. way he's talking to me. <laughs> get I'm used to it. To think of like some... Do we have a HR department at Milkman Studios yet? <laughs> yeah, Simon, he doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can we actually make that a thing if we ever get things? <laughs> Simon's the HR department. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Danny's been sexually harassing me. So I'm just like, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Danny just, made a really yeah. inappropriate racist comment. What the fuck are you telling <laughs> me for, dickhead? I don't give a shit. Yeah, he does the opposite. He like encourages. <laughs> he encourages Danny. Yeah. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> Sorry, let's go. Uh, that was it. Oh, well, I would show it, but I'm holding a mic, so. But you um, hold. You hold yeah. the mic for him. Oh, for fuck's sake. Got, you can't just say you can do it. You can say anything. I haven't done it in a while, so I might be a bit rusty. So. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't know the wide shot. It's probably going to be harder because it's tied up. Oh! Oh, oh my. Ah. What the fuck? I wasn't expecting that. I don't know what I was expecting, but that Not freaked that. me out. Oh my God. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Hope you're happy. Jesus Christ. Never do that again. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm a little bit turned on. <laughs> I don't know why. It's always good. I wanted to see our reactions. I was genuine. I was like, what? <laughs> That's the thumbnail sorted. <laughs> Wait, get a thumbnail, quick. <laughs> I don't know why I turned into like, some sort of retarded T-Rex. <laughs> uh, nice. I guarantee when we did that, Stephen did nothing. Yeah, no, of course. <laughs> like, I had no reaction to it. You were like freaking out. I was just there like, <laughs> that's, pretty good. that's just normal reaction for anything <laughs> uh, Stephen you got any hidden talents go on there must um, be something talking really. yeah talking <laughs> <laughs> could talk for whales <laughs> like, uh, it's difficult with him isn't it mm, yeah, I think what was, no, what was, doesn't matter oh shit you alright yeah 
I can hold my breath. Forever. <laughs> <laughs> no, just I don't, don't stop. Yeah. I don't I don't really have any hidden talents. I can do this with my thumb. Like, the little the old Woo <laughs> Mate, oldest trick in the book. Here we go. Try and do it with your cock. That, that's hard. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> well, it doesn't have to be. No. I'm double jointed in oh, oh, yeah. both of my yeah. elbows, which is weird because look. Um just shut off the guns. Sorry, Steve, hold on. So that's that's about normal, isn't it? Mm. That's about straight, and then <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, it's just fucked, just fucked. I also, <laughs> where's what? this going? What? No, I just remembered as you're doing that. Can't you do your eyes? I mean, your eyes like one look cross eye. Yeah, no, one look white. We can all do cross I swear, eye, you basically. can do one look in and one look away. No. Oh, like Pennywise, lazy eye. I swear. Uh, what? what like. Kind of. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the podcast. Um, yeah. Oh, God, that's hurt my eyes, actually. Mm, with the lights no, and everything. One of my hidden talents, and not many people know that I can actually do, is juggle. Mm. I can actually juggle. Oh, God, I forgot about that. Yeah. You got any balls? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I've got four. Um, when did you learn to do that, then? <laughs> Five yards. Clown school or something. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. uh, after school club. Bless. And it was like juggling club or cl- something like I've that. Done, I've done like a clown. Th- I can do, I can go on stilts. That's my sort of thing. Uh, I learned how to uh, juggle and unicycle. Oh well, that's actually quite cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It nice. isn't cool, Ellis. No, fucking nerd. That's, 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 that's how you can propose to Rose. <laughs> On a unicycle. <laughs> I was juggling. Well, I was the juggling. one of the, the rings. Yeah. <laughs> she has to try and catch it, otherwise she can't get my like, Yeah, yeah. eventually like, three balls and they're on the box, and eventually just the box left, and you land off the unicycle. And you're no. Like, why are we onto something here? Nah, why are we nah I don't. Do you know what? I don't even say how I'm going to do it. Will Did you I? marry no, me? <laughs> well, yeah, that's about it. Yeah. Go yeah. in Edinburgh. Yeah, and I'm gonna ask her. Um, You're gonna do the whole like <clears throat> find a perfect spot, get on a knee, and then fucking sneeze and drop the box, and then it goes tumbling away, and you have to chase it for an hour. It hasn't got legs, mate. We're about <laughs> no. We're going to uh, an Italian near Edinburgh Castle, oh. and then after the food, I'm gonna yeah. go, we're gonna go for a walk, and then um, walk around the castle and that, and then I'll ask her somewhere. I'll just like find a spot that I like. Beautiful. Hopefully not get mugged or something, you know. Be... Steal the ring. Yeah. Not that ring, though. Uh, <laughs> in the news, Millie Bobby Brown admits she doesn't watch any of her own movies. Uh, Netflix star Millie Bobby Brown. So, let's be fair, no one does. Moving on. Yeah, watch their know. own movies or just... No, Millie Bobby Brown. Millie Bobby Brown. What? <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Eleven from yeah. Strange Things. She, I've watched um, one of her new films. I Damsel. Damsel. Fucking awful. Don't watch it. Wasn't planning Damn. on. <laughs> so. <laughs> that's literally all I've got. Was so has it? anyone like, got any like, That's like a normal thing for There's nothing do. going on, mate. Nothing has happened. Literally nothing, no. Or Kate Middleton. What's that? Oh. That's, that's risky business talking about that. <laughs> Why is it? Is it political? Is it? I don't. To be fair, Danny isn't here. So mm. we are pretty safe. What happened, Steve? Give oh, us context. She went miss. Oh, everyone like you know the AI. Oh, there was like a picture that came out that looked like it was like photoshopped. Mm. And people were concerned about oh where's she gone? Like you know she's like been missing. So people thought oh she was hospitalised. So it's like but then they put this like fake picture out of like her with three like her three kids mm. and it was like there was bits of it that was just weird like daughter's arm was what, like dodgy. an official press thing. Yeah, it was like a proper picture and it came out and it just looked a bit dodgy and it, everyone was like. Ooh, what's, yeah, what's happening here like because they put that out to be like oh look she's fine mm-hmm. but then uh i don't know like people have been saying like theories and stuff have been like the what you're saying, wasn't there something about it cancer came back, yeah it came out that she did like a proper video where she was like she had, she had, had. Got cancer oh. and she's doing treatments that's why she's not thing so gotcha. everyone was like doing these like massive like theories about yeah, oh, all like this conspiracy stuff, theorists conspiracy everywhere theories, but it just turns out she just had cancer and she's just doing Damn. treatments for it i don't know anyway <laughs> <laughs> Damn. You should look. Yeah, I'll, I'll show you the picture after. Like, okay. Just so you can understand what. Gotcha. What yeah, um, it was a bit weird though because it it was like weirdly edited. Mm. But then obviously now it's like understandable because. Well, she, you know, trying she's to going through put an image that. out and whatever. Yeah. It, but then it didn't help that because it obviously wasn't her. But someone put on her social media. Oh, I just normally edit my photos. It's like no, you don't. 
<laughs> that reminds me of someone. You get someone else to do it for you. <clears throat> Out of context. Joke. Well mm. done, Alice. <laughs> now they're not going to understand. Nah, I know. It's but great. yeah. That's it. Cheers nice. for bringing that up. Yeah. Cheery fucking subject, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Better than out. Millie Bobby Brown doesn't watch films. <laughs> it was. <laughs> Anyone else got any really fucking depressing shit that we can talk about? Why are you looking at me? <laughs> <laughs> any depressing, sad news lately? Or you pretty... Nothing comes to mind. <laughs> have you still got that app that I requested you to put on? He has not used it in apps. But have you still got it? Yeah, I haven't deleted it. Oh, fair play. I respect that. Have you? Yeah, I haven't even clicked on it since thing in it, but yeah. Can so, I click on it? Boring. Mm. There you go. Grinder. That's installed. I hardly know her. <laughs> um No, I can't think of anything. What no, nothing's going on. I mean I could talk about Formula One, but that's not gonna interest any one of you, so <laughs> something like that. Yeah. But then Max Verstappen. <laughs> tired from the race. Why? Oh now you're interested. No. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He, he had a um, in one of his brakes literally like caught fire and then exploded. It was pretty intense. If there was Couldn't more explosions me. in F one, I think would be interested, mm. wouldn't we? Well, yeah. there was that one with Lewis a few years ago, wasn't there? Was that where was that? Where is what? Oh, it exploded. Yeah, he was on fire. <laughs> yeah, so sometimes the engines do just <laughs> usually what happens when an explosion. <laughs> no, some they do. They just like it happens because they they get so hot. Yeah, but yeah, where engines. was that? I don't know. Like, there was one in Malaysia in, like, 2016. I think, yeah. I've seen the video. It's fucked. Yeah. And then, um, but yeah, Max Verstappen, he's been obviously winning so many races. And he was on, last year he did, he set the record for the most consecutive wins, which is 10. Mm. Anyway, at the moment he was on nine. So he was, if he'd won the race, he would have set, beat his same, well, he would have matched his same record. But obviously, yeah, he didn't. So obviously everyone was buzzing because it's like, He's been dominating. So as soon as he left, as soon as he retired, everyone's going crazy. Was mm. did you watch? <laughs> mm. <laughs> <laughs> That's about as much as you get from Stephen. <laughs> Doesn't did, say words just because it was noises. at like four a.m. Yeah. Wasn't it? Did you get up? Yeah. You are so sad. It's a Sunday afternoon. Yeah. Mon- morning. Sorry. I would have been more depressive. I got up to watch Max Verstappen win again. So I was kind of happy that he didn't. Yeah. Who did you support then? London Norris. Oh, yeah, of course. And I don't even know why I asked that. Literally <laughs> wank over the guy. He's a good-looking yeah. lad. Why I have no him? idea what he looks like, so Hold I on. can't be the judge. <laughs> You've got Just pictures of me. him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you... Moonlighting as an F1 racer. Whoa. Good catch. Cool. Yeah, I love that we was... went from Millie Bobby Brown to F1 no, we, very, no, very no. quickly. We You missed out a bit there where Stephen brought up some very fucking interesting... <laughs> Cancer subject. Royal news. Yeah. Are you a royalist, Stephen? No. Well, that's a bit tight, mate. She's mm. got cancer. Yeah. Can you not? What I mean, show some fucking respect. Yeah. Jesus, Stephen. What is wrong with you? I mean, she's literally <laughs> going to be the queen. Can you not? That's a good point. What with like Freddie Mercury? Oh. <laughs> 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 no, I can't. <laughs> no. Go on. Go. Just if she makes it. <laughs> Fucking hell. That was actually pretty <laughs> rough from him. I can't believe he said that. That is sick, mate. Yeah, that is That's too Steven. far. Yeah. Just, sorry. She's yeah, got I'm going to apologize. We'll, yeah, we'll get ahead of yeah. the fucking thing here. Yeah. Don't cancel us. Mm. We are sorry. You Actually, why are we saying... You mm. say sorry. I fucking <laughs> meant it. <laughs> Did you unplug my mic? <laughs> uh, well. Yeah, sound. Yikes. Okay. Well, if you haven't already, make sure to follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. <laughs> With the handle at Watch Milkman. As if you don't, then Alice will find himself inexorably descending into the abyss of despondency, grappling with the labyrinthine complexities of his psyche as he becomes ensnared in the tendrils of profound melancholia, as he's the one who posts on Twitter every day. So please give it a follow. You generally put that into um, AI. AI yeah. I do not know what any of those words mean. <laughs> I think that could a- be some sort of racist propaganda. <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> Some, <laughs> you saw them when you support like yeah. ISIS or something. No, 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 no. Do you not? What? Ah, <laughs> moving on. <laughs> at, at Watch Milkman. Um, I actually looked at the Twitter today. Mm. Yeah. It's just waffling it. That's yeah, good. you're I, welcome. I love it. It's fucking content. Get re- a grip. I retweeted one the other day. It was just like... Oh, Milk is Lit fam. Yeah, that yeah. was it. <laughs> <laughs> love that one. 
<laughs> then your mum liked one actually. It's easy. We. Yeah, she told me. Wait, she, she said uh, she opened up the milkman thing and they just need to post better content. She said <laughs> better she content. Like, she said she read, she read one of them last week and she was like, "What complete crap?" That's what she <laughs> yeah. said. Yeah, that's yeah. what she said to me. Yeah, so go and follow them. Yeah, so uh, stay. How about own. you uh, write a few tweets then? Okay. How yeah, about that? Pull your finger out. Yeah. Okay, okay now. I didn't even know you posted <laughs> tweets to be fair. We've been doing this for over a year and we've always said about Twitter. How do you not know that? Yeah, because but I looked at it today and I'm like, oh my god, you post every day. Well, I don't. He does. It's not me. They're anyway. scheduled. They're a month in advance. Oh, are they? <laughs> so you know, give us an extra month. <laughs> okay, uh, Colonel Conversation, which is a conversation between the four of us today, because we haven't even said why. Oh, so Danny, it's a point they're not even part of it anymore. Yeah, we may as well. <laughs> even just... I show up more than them, which is odd. It's That's really not right. Really to be honest. We should just kick them out. Where are they actually? Danny's just didn't Couldn't let us know where he was. Helpful. And Simon is away watching Pendulum. Mm. Yeah. Yep. I don't know where. Manchester. Man- he was at the mm. Manchester United Stadium, wasn't he? Yeah. Shit hole. Don't go there. Um, <laughs> sorry. Yeah. Where reference. we delve into the hypotheticals of the world's most notorious and despicable questions that we now encourage you, the audience, to send us. Please send us some questions. I John knows good every for that. week, <laughs> and it's about every other fucking month that we get one. So please send some questions in. Right, hypothetical question for today: If you won the lottery and didn't tell anyone, what subtle signs or changes would people start noticing in your life? <laughs> so you haven't told anyone that you've won, but you're still going to act mm. like you've won the lottery. What are some of the sort of things that people would notice to start with? Like I get a new golden tooth every month. <laughs> that's his go-to. I'm just like, what? That's his first thought. Gold teeth. How, how no, that's... have we got to be? Ferrari well, no, it's just what drive. you would do. What would if you won the lottery and you didn't want to tell anyone? What was what would be the first subtle thing that people would notice about you? Like you actually bother to like look good. <laughs> Or, you know, have a wash once in a while. <laughs> or You're talking about Jerry. No. <laughs> no. No. Have a de- sorry, have a decent, decent haircut. haircut. Yeah. 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 Um, house, car. That's about it. Wife. <laughs> <laughs> Buy <Well>. a wife. <laughs> to be fair, if Jerry's a bit much there, Steve. <laughs> if Bezos can do it with all that money, so can you. Just buy one. Yeah. You can go on those websites. That's what I was suggesting. Oh, uh, of course it was. He's been looking, hasn't he? You are oh, weird, yeah. mate. <laughs> Kate Middleton, now this. You're off the fucking chain. You're off the fucking rail, son. Go on, what about Steve? you? Me? Yeah. Or Steve? Well, either one of you. Well, tell me you. Mm. What? <laughs> tell me tell which you. one. Stephen. Stephen. I'd just disappear. <laughs> what? Like Moves. usually kills himself. I'd, I'd like... move away. <laughs> Where? Why? Funny. <laughs> oh, I'm going to prank on my mates by leaving. No contact. <laughs> not, not even your family. No, just go. That wouldn't be a prank. Be you wouldn't even live in a nice place. You'd just buy a little shitty apartment like in Sweden or something. Yeah. Caravan. Nice. Yeah, caravan. Hang on a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Funnily enough, I fucking in one. <laughs> just take it with me. Yeah. Well, you can. It's only 500 yeah. quid. <laughs> there you go. He just moves the caravan. You just don't spend any of the money. Yeah, he just pays someone to move the caravan to a different <laughs> country. You spend it on. <laughs> so you've won 100 mil. You right, just... I'm spending 500 quid. I'm going to move my caravan. <laughs> going to work in the uh, Swedish equivalent of Tesco. Mm. Mm. I don't know what that is. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> that. <laughs> Ellis, you actually gold teeth. Is that your. I took that from a uh, Post Malone's page. When he got his meals, he uh, got those gold grills, didn't he? Oh, um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. There was a big trend on that. I don't really see that often. No, I fucking no. hate it. Because um, Kanye's got some grills, hasn't he? And oh, like full sil- oh Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't really get it. I'm glad he's kind of out of the picture. Mm. He's still doing stuff, Racist. but everyone's like, you were so 2010. What What happened? Like, what, He just sort of switched. So there was the anti-Semitism, and then... He just seems very, very uh, vulnerable mentally. Yeah, he's bipolar, isn't he? Is he? I Are you talking about that. Danny or Kanye? Both. 
Have you not seen oh, Danny's new gold grills? <laughs> Is one of that remake? Damn. He doesn't want to tell anybody, but I, I figured it out. Oh. What would I do? If I, if I won the lottery. You would get a new house. You would get a fucking dog sanctuary. Yeah, that's a subtle change. Because, I'd just buy a dog every week. We would just see you with a new dog. I'd buy some actual decent clothes. Apart from the t-shirt. My t-shirt's really fucking nice. It's Milkman original, weirdly enough. <laughs> um, no, I'd buy some like, I don't know. Nice clothes, what do you mean? I, just, I wear literally just Primark t-shirt and shorts at the moment. What's That's wrong literally with that? Literally my, my outfit. What's wrong with that? Nothing. You're supporting local business. <laughs> <laughs> I do actually. I go to the charity shop. There you go. But I would stop doing that. <laughs> if I won the lottery, I'd stop. No, I wouldn't help charity. No, you would just go to the expensive charity shops. <laughs> no. Really? <laughs> no. Get a would... nice Versace shirt from London. No, 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 no. That's, from the that's charity garbage. shop. That's garbage. I'd buy something speaking more expensive. Of... <laughs> I don't know what is more expensive than Versace. Um, speaking of expensive clothing, completely derailing it. But I've got a picture on my phone that I meant to send to you, Stephen, when I went to some place, I can't remember where, and they had like a really expensive clothing line. But they had a cap with like a logo on it that I thought would perfectly suit you. And it was just basically that smiley face, but with a straight mouth. <laughs> So, there you go. <laughs> yeah, you just literally, literally just done, done it. Done it now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll send it to you yeah, later, but there you go. I need the context of the picture. Brilliant. It's just a cap with that, like, a stitched logo of that face. So, I'll buy it. Well, I won't buy it. It's no. too fucking expensive. <laughs> that's what you should buy if Excuse you win me. the lottery. All right. Well, I think we answer that. Bonus question. If your Uncle Jack helped you off an elephant... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Would you help your Uncle Jack off an elephant? <laughs> you hang on, hang on, read it again. Okay. Would you help Jack off an elephant or would if you help No, Jack? no, if your Uncle Jack helped you off an elephant, would you... <laughs> <laughs> Would you help your Uncle Jack off an elephant? Uh, no. Oh, I haven't not? even got an Uncle Jack. No, nobody <laughs> has. No. Alright, moving on. <laughs> <laughs> right, now, for the next segment, we normally do change game. We can do change game, mm. or we can do um, that one word... Association. Association thing, thing or there's a new one Ooh. that I have found. So Ooh, okay. can give that a go. And if it we fails, then we go back to the others. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sound. Question quandary quizzical quest. Whoa. We've got a fucking name for this one, boys. Which is an improv game where the group decides a scenario, then participants must act out the scene speaking only in questions. If a player hesitates in answering the question with a question, they're out. And the game continues until the last player remains. Oh, okay. I think I get so it. So just everyone takes it in turn saying something, but you've got to respond with, with a, question. a question. It's it's just always got to be a question. Okay. Okay. I so like, like it. you then, that would have worked because mm -hmm. you asked me a question. But if you'd have just said, I my name's it. Chris. My name's Jamal Chris. <laughs> yeah, that would have worked. <laughs> my name's Chris. <laughs> then yeah. But if my name's Chris. No. You get it? I do. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. We can either come up with a scenario, or I've got one here. I suggest we come up with one, because this isn't very good. We could use it as an example. Okay, here's an example. A passenger suddenly realises they're on the wrong flight as the plane takes off. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on the wrong... F oh, no. Uh, I think I'm on the wrong flight. That's not... A mm, is that a question? I don't know if that's a question. That's a more of a statement. Am I on the wrong flight? flight? Okay, maybe we start with a statement, then. Okay, to make it easier. I think I'm on the wrong flight. What makes you say that? Is it, is it, is it just again? between you two? <laughs> yeah. I don't yeah. know. It's not going to go round. It? Yeah, it's, round. it's sort of got to go round. Yeah. Isn't it? I was going to say, like... That's a very two-way conversation. We need to make it a bit broader. Yeah. Um, trying to think of a scenario where four people would be involved. A podcast. <laughs> we're on a podcast. <laughs> and we're talking about the ethics of anal. 
Like, <laughs> <laughs> like you were going for it, and then you were like, oh, wait, wait a minute. minute. <laughs> are there any ethics behind? Oh, no, actually, there are, to be fair. Mm. <laughs> You're welcome for that. Chris, you got any other suggestions? <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, Unless that was your question. <laughs> <laughs> and you're out. <laughs> Damn. Right, should we just... <laughs> I'm just trying it's, to work out how it would work. We're having more trouble think of a scenario than the actual yeah, game it's, itself. It's not, it's not boding well that we're good at improv, is it? Because <laughs> we can't fucking come up with a scenario. It doesn't have to involve all four of us, though. I've just thought of one, and it's really dumb. We're in one of those singing quartet things. Okay. And we're trying to figure out who's singing first because we've forgotten. All right. Am I singing first? I don't think so. Are you singing first? or? <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure. This is going to get old real yeah. quick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not uh, it's just that's the change. It'd have to be the same as the change game where it picks yeah. two people. Okay. I think it would have to be the case. Narrow it down, okay. We won't do that scenario. Um, so it's Stephen and Chris then? Yeah. What? Yeah. Goes. <laughs> oh! Starting again. <laughs> because me and. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right. Attitude? Do you know what I mean? Mm. I can invite him to my house. <laughs> this, is, this isn't going to work, but okay. Uh, what's the question? The plane one. The scenario is. Yeah, the plane. So yeah, let's go for it. Passenger suddenly, so a passenger suddenly realizes they're on the wrong flight as the plane takes off. Uh, excuse me, I think I missed. I think I'm on the wrong flight. Are you? <laughs> yeah, I think I just said that. That's not a question. That's a statement. That's a statement. See, that's Chris the wins. Statement. Yay. <laughs> Fucking hell, let's revert back to the other change one. Change game. Do you oh, want right. to do a change game then? Yeah. All right. But then change. Or we do that one word thing because yeah, that does okay. involve all of us. Okay. Well, yeah. Try that. But I can't okay. what we do. So, um, plane. Well, I forgot what, what you, I do. Fucking <laughs> okay, what first, do I do? You first word, plane. First word that comes to your head <laughs> after oh, I say mine. Okay. Oh, no, you said plane. Yeah, we know where <laughs> that's going. <laughs> <laughs> um, twin Towers. <laughs> <laughs> Two words. Sure. <laughs> New York. City. Statue. Liberty. America. States. New York. <laughs> <laughs> Twin Towers. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh, <laughs> building. Windows. PC. Mac. <laughs> Mac Miller. Ooh, Ooh we changed it up. Rap. Travis. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out. I don't want to say mine. <laughs> no. <laughs> No, I was just a uh, uh, rapper. Eminem. The, it Are wasn't you what you thought, by the way. <laughs> no, no, I know, I know. Eminem, spaghetti. Uh, meatball. Dog? <laughs> what? I don't know. I swear I've seen a TikTok of a dog called Meatball. <laughs> you could have said Cloudy. Uh, well, uh, well, it's not uh, your fucking go, is it? Is it my go? Yeah. After, what did you say? Dog. 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 Pug. Uh, oh, what's it called? Uh, like when Hang you on. can't breathe. He's hesitating. I'm not hesitating. I that can't think hesitation. of the... like, it's, it's He's swaffling. Literally, he's literally describing suffocation. Suffocation. That was the word. Okay. If that happens again, you're out. <laughs> you're <getting laughs> That's fine. Suffocated. <laughs> Shit myself. Uh, Strangling. Chris. Me. <laughs> yeah, that was the word. <laughs> Me. Oh. Um, good looking. <laughs> Two words. Hanson. Lies. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, it got me uh, there. Truth. Dare. Stunts. Stunts. What does that mean? As in, like, in context, give me. He's. He's waffling oh, again. No, I, I'm not sure. I don't. What is? Yeah. Stunts. Like a, like, a, like a stunt. A, like a stunt. Daredevil. Dare, like, exactly. Oh, daredevil. Oh, okay. I'll get you. Stunt man. Car. Stunt car. Driving. Danny. I don't know. He just likes cars. Okay. Annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Danny. <laughs> We're all boffling. <laughs> When's this ending? How does it end? Well, I mean, to be fair, it's supposed to end. I thought it was elimination. 
when but, someone doesn't say it straight away. It's like got to be instant. Mm. He's been waffling. You've been hesitating now and again. All right. It's all right. <laughs> Stephen wins. He yeah. always wins. He's got a fucking caravan. Well, uh, we'll, we'll reboot that. Do it on the next one, but I'll give it a few tweaks. Yeah. We're, well, we're still working on it. We're only mm. 25 episodes <laughs> in. <laughs> That's quarter of 100. We'll get Yeah, it is. High five, mate. Well done. Really, you're really good at math. How many episodes has Joe Rogan done? Is it like 2,000? Something like that. He does one a week, though, doesn't he? So, How many weeks is that? 52. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How many is in 2000? You just want every week. How many How weeks many? is that? <laughs> that is a pretty dumb question. I meant like how long in, in a yeah, year. Yeah, so yeah. 52. Fucking hell. Four years? What? What? He's been going. Oh, 100. Oh, 100. Sorry. No, yeah. Bad math. Uh, uh, I got to 200, not 52. Oh, uh, okay. I was going to say. I don't know what's Four. happening. Yeah, Joe Rogan. He's um, been doing it from the beginning of time. <laughs> right, I'm just going to fucking say the closing word. All right. Final segment, which is Simon's Milk Facts. Simon says one of his favourite facts about milk, and because he's not here, he's dead again. We've had to get it recorded, and I, I apologise in advance because it sounds like he's talking into <laughs> a potato. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I heard it before. Did you know the first milk bottle ever invented was invented in 1884? That's 140 years ago. That's how old I am. That genuinely made me laugh. The it first sounds time I heard like it. he recorded that 140 years ago, to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> what was man recording? He was churning on? something to get yeah. the recording, yeah. What was he on? Uh, Microwave. <laughs> what was it again? The milk bottle. Oh, the milk bottle from ni- 1884, or something like that. It's mad, that, isn't it? Three days milk. Three days. <laughs> Just uh? The bottle's empty. <laughs> Just calling it a milk bottle doesn't know what milk is yet. Yeah, yeah it's just a bottle, surely. No, they've called it the milk bottle, but there's no nothing to associate what, the word milk yet. What makes it a milk bottle, though? Just the shape, or like, I don't know. I was joking. No, do you know what I'm saying, though? <laughs> yeah, what makes it a what milk bottle? What makes a bottle specifically a milk bottle? Well, yeah. they've just probably designed it for that particular use, but probably doesn't have any differentiation from a normal bottle. Well, there you go. You've learned something new. So you just because, don't get this anywhere else, do you? No, really? because other podcasts are good. Mm. <laughs> because in my head, milk bottles are like got a really, really short and thin neck, and it's just rest of it the same size. I'm gonna cut it here before it gets. Too I'm not much talking about it. bottles, by the way. I'm talking about my. Pe- That's when we. Cut. <laughs> We're keeping this in. <laughs> oh. See you later. <laughs> Bye. Damn.